Hey yo, what is going on guys and welcome back to another video on my channel. Today we are back in the F1 game and we are doing a special little challenge. A lot of you already know the format of can I beat the pole from different YouTubers. And actually recently I've seen a comment asking if we could attempt doing that. And I think most people mean it in a set of Corsa, but you know what? I want to try to go on the F1 game and drive the realistic worst car on the game without a setup and try and beat Max Verstappen's 2024 pole lap time. So we're here in the house and as you can see, we do not have a setup on. It's the basic setup. The only thing we are changing is of course the on throttle and the brakes because that is what we can change without actually changing the setup like fully. We will park Fermi and the dog is coming over, Luna. Dog, this is Luna. So uh, just so you also know her. <laughs> but now I have to record the video. So, without further talking, let's get into the action. Let's get on the track. Okay, here we go. I think with the house and default setup, we actually have to sweat this a little bit. It's not gonna be the easiest challenge of all time. But I think we can do it. I would just put it on 50 brake bikes everywhere because the house is anyways terrible on the brakes. Look at this. No locking. No nothing. Sorry, two point one. Out of sector one, pretty terrible happen. And I don't know what's the biggest issue with the house, if it's corner performance or straight line or both. But I can tell you one thing, the car does not feel great. The livery looks good though. Honestly, the onboard of the house in 2024 looks amazing. And just saying that, if you want to have the F1 2024 skins, go on race department, Venturi Studios, F1 24 mod, and there you can drive this car which i'm driving as well right now you know if it gets too hard we might actually have to um put a setup on but let's get a first idea what a pace looking like of that car it's definitely not a 27 it's a 28022 so we are missing six temps It should be doable without setup. So let's focus up. Oh, that was a bit too early turning. Had to lift off at the exit. Is it purple in sector one? No, it's red. That definitely should be faster than before. Always using all the track here, close to the wall. Oh no. Oh, okay. Not good. Oh, I was just thinking, am I actually recording? Oh yeah, we are over half a second off. So the first, or second lap, was actually pretty good. The first actual lap was pretty good. It's not amazing, obviously. I actually put the brake wise now to 52 because I do not know. I mean, I don't think we have to use 52. I think we can use 50, but maybe we'll use 51. Car feels terrible. <laughs> I wonder if there's any Haas employee like that is working for the team or in some way related to it watching and if so I'm sorry man I'm not trying to roast you guys okay They're actually one of the coolest teams in the team because you guys are an underdog fighting hard this is entertainment, alright? Trying to get the content. 
Oh my god, but this is not content, this is pain what I'm doing here. Second time that we missed the apex. This might actually be an improvement on lap one. We can't get the car to rotate, that's the biggest issue. 27.777, okay, we are getting there, three times to go. I somehow can't get the car to stop. I can't get the car, oh, that's an envelop. Oh, maybe not. Was nice. Exit wasn't. Definitely slower than before. Two turns off. And we can gain a lot of time here in the middle. Should still be able to improve on that lap. That is much better. Focus a bit more on the exit. Probably one and a half tenths gain there. Next high speed is also still a lot of gain in there. Well, we need to break way early than we think. Car is slow. I choose this. But that is looking good. There was decent rotation, no spinning on the exit, and it's at 713, even though we had a 2 tenths loss. Yeah, okay, maybe 50 is a bit too much. We can actually lock the rear. One sec, I wonder should be fine. Oh, that was very nice. Close to the wall. What was it? Bad. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Maybe actually 52 break wise is good. You know, I'm after playing AC, a lot of a sort of Corsa, I changed my BRF, I changed my brakes a lot. And now my braking in F1 is so slow. The lines are very important here. That's a bit, look, we missed the line a little bit and then we are already not able to hook this up. 31 and, yeah, a bit better than before, but still. Pretty trash. This is gonna be hard to improve here. Line was a bit better into it, but out of it was way too slow, way too careful. Slowed the car down too much. Okay, I think we we can we can definitely go for the pole, but it's it's not gonna be easy. Another 27, a little improvement, we're getting closer. Okay. Come on, we have to nail the line. We need to hit a, like 31.8 in the first sector. But not like this. We don't need to hit the wall. We need to hit the 31.8. But you can already see, we're definitely able to go there. 
I think 26 is more than realistic. I'm not as warmed up in the F1 game at the moment, so there's way more time to find than what I'm doing at the moment. That was pretty clean. That was not. I think we might still have an improvement in the sector one if we hit the lines. Oh uh, yeah, of course we miss it. We missed the turn. Not as good as before, but still decent. Hooked it up nicely over the right hand curb and kept it in fifth to try it out. Well, that was not good. Lost a lot for the exit there, but it's still good in terms of the pace. I think we have to rotate the car a little bit more on throttle. I think I'm a bit too careful. Oh, that was nice. That was very nice. I think this should be our best shot at actually achieving this challenge and beating Max. Oh my god. I messed it up. I don't think this is going to be enough. We're losing so much time now. Is it going to be enough though? 25, 26, 27? No, man, no. <laughs> We were so close. Back to using fourth gear. Back to being useless. Uh. That's the lap time that we gotta be. 27.472. One tenth and we have it. And to be fair, Nico put it, I think, in Q3, no? Or was that in Bahrain? I think it was Bahrain, maybe. Hmm. Never mind. I will take it back then. Back into fifth. Because screw fourth. People on eSports call me the high gear merchant for a reason. And there it is. Using the trucker wings of the Haas. Mate, I'm suffering so much from FPS jobs because of race lap. I do not know why this is causing so much issue. I'm not even using the overlay. Man, that was such a good lap. And then race laps ruined it. Screw you, race lap. That was nice. Come on, hook it up, man. Hook it up. Mm. 
too much curb. Way too much curb. Tap the wall without a rear of our car. This is the lap. It must be. I feel it. Slow over the curb. I think it's a zero in the first, not good. For nine, still okay. This was way off the line. Brake too late with that car. Like I said, the braking performance is not that good. That was okay, I think the curb cost us a little bit of time because we hooked it up a bit too much over it. But we still can do this if we get a good run th through the high speed. Left, right. Too slow. No, way too slow. Way too slow. I slowed down way too much. I think you have to stay in sixth gear. It feels like a fifth key corner with the Haas, but it is definitely sixth gear. God damn it, man. Not the one. I think it's close, but it's not the one. It's not the one. No, <laughs> it was so close, man. We are missing six thousandths of a second. Okay, okay. Trucker wings added again. It was a bit slower. Couldn't rotate it that nicely on the brakes. But the trucker wings are working. High gear merchant stick gear, come on. Or well, maybe it is actually not six, uh, six gear. Oh, I'm so confused. Come on, let it be the one. Bit of wheel spin and a bit of, I think I picked the wrong brake bias into the final corner. No, there we are. But uh, you know what, we're going for one bonus lap. We did it. We already did it. We did beat Max's lap. Oh man, a bit too much curve, but I was not satisfied, so we are going again. And this is better than sector one already. No, oh, way worse. We definitely lost a lot of time there. But this was absolutely lovely. And we had a worse run through that corner, but still we carried more minimum speed. So I think we might actually be going for a great lap here. It was cleaner, but I think it was a bit slower. Is it a 0.6 though? Is it a 6? Okay. 
I fully underestimated that fast left right how much time we left there by not pushing yes we went over the curb but we carried so much more speed through there that is way faster wait am i tripping yeah i am i make i thought i get oh man i thought we had a 27.6 okay never mind um so we lost time in the final sector <laughs> i'm stupid i'm really stupid but you can see we progress slowly there's definitely 26 in there uh, we are a little bit washed so um this happens um but we did the challenge, we completed it in 29 minutes and 55 seconds. Okay, we did it a little bit before that, but this is how long the recording is going on. You've met Luna the dog, and I hope you also enjoyed the video. So if you like both, leave a like, subscribe, hit the bell, leave a comment. If we shoot this, uh, if we shoot this, if we should do this every weekend when there's F1 on, I will still do the Bahrain GP as well, but this one was more recent, so I think you guys want to see that. I wish you a lovely day, have a great one. Also check out my Instagram, make sure to follow there as well. And I will see you in the next one, you yourself.